Welcome. Thank you. Have a seat, please. Well, thank you for inviting me here today. Um, but uh, what can I answer for you? Tell me about yourself. What well, brings you here? Um, I grew up in Iowa, um, which I feel kind of started me off really well, uh, just because I worked on farms. I worked um, really where you had to work as hard as you could in a short amount of time as you could, um, and that really has. Uh, Helped me over the years. Um, as I grew from that, um, since that really wasn't the direction that I wanted to go, I found more of a passion in uh, kind of the food and beverage industry. Uh, I found a lot of creativity. Um, I started out at Subway, um, which is kind of build your own type of thing, and I really like doing that. Um, one thing that I found that I enjoyed was helping people and making their needs. talking with people and getting to know them and trying to help them out on that side of things. I've also worked in kind of a hotel resort um, doing conventions and all sorts of things actually. I mean, I've worked in the cafe and the front desk and uh, the whole resort aspect. And I still feel like the food and beverage is more in the direction that I wanted to go with it. Uh, so that's why Mr. Donnelly. Any feedback? I think I would bring Iowa in later. Okay. Mm -hmm. Start talking about yourself and get the. I mean, when you talk about Fridays, when you talk about Fridays in class and then coming in the bartender room and going in that, okay, that makes you light up. Yeah. It's just what you want to do here. Yeah. You know, you want to show that side of that. And so you can get to that sooner. And It's not a linear timeline. It's a, it, right, but it's, just so that yeah. it had some structure. <clears throat> yeah. The structure is your passion, and I didn't okay. get the sense of why do you really want to do this. All I got was a list of all your jobs that you did. Okay. But I got no sense of why you want to do this. It, it's almost, you just kind of presented it matter of fact. Um, this is what I've done. I, I made this decision back in Iowa, and I've done this job and this job and this job and this job. And I didn't really get a sense of even the jobs. I just got, well, I have experience in this, I have experience in that. I didn't even get a sense of that. And so I almost felt like I just had a life-size version of your resume instead of getting right. Adam. Right. Does that make sense? Yeah. And so I, really, I think the key question is, why do you really want to do this? Why do you want to be? Well, and I tried to, I mean, <clears throat> I tried to show that with, like, no, answer, the part, answer my question. But why do you really want to do this? Why do I want to do the job? Why, why do you want to be in the business? Why, why do I want to be in the business? business? Yeah. I, just, I just love helping people. It's something that I've done for years, and I've just, I've just enjoyed it. I mean, why do you enjoy it? I, the people that I work with and the people that I work for have always been uh, the, the, a lot of fun and a lot of Why is that important to you? I really could tell you. It's just one of the things that like I just want to do. I, I mean, like Mr. Donnelly said, like when I talk about things um, in, uh, about Fridays, I don't know why I didn't come up today, but I, I do. I, I know that I light up. I know that I have this like feeling that I, it's just what I want to do. You have to be able to answer the question, why is it important to you? Because otherwise you're not going to be able to light up you have to come up with your line. You know what I mean? Yeah. Spend a few days, come up yeah, with it, and you then go. Go. you go. Spew it out when they say it. Whatever it is, take some time to think. 
yeah, yeah, and and memorize it. I too. don't expect you necessarily to have that answer like right now yeah. at the second, but that's what I was trying to get at. Okay. Because the closer you get to who it is, what it, why it is, what it is, that's that makes it easier to communicate. And if you haven't, if you haven't been there yet, if you haven't thought about it yet, of course you don't have the words for it. But um, you have to find the words because you have to be able to communicate that to someone who is meeting you for the first time. Okay. And, you know, it's that part of you that is was completely missing today. Yeah. In medical terms, this was flatlining. Yes. Right. It was just uh, all good. Yeah, in publishing terms, right? It was yeah, through a right. piece of paper. So. Yeah. But I want, I want Adam. Yeah. And I don't want, I don't want the BS Adam. I don't want, right. you know, Which, I want the right. true Adam. Yeah. yeah. Because, because, see, you're good enough. You're gonna do well, right? Yeah. 